All right, folks. I am here in San Francisco. Google had invited me and a bunch of other amazing creators to attend the Google I/O 2025. A lot has happened. They have announced so many amazing things that you are gonna be shocked. But because I'm here in SF, I'll pass this over to Divyanshi because she has written down everything important about it and its impact on you, your work, and your personal life. So let's get started. Google has brought some absolutely mind-blowing updates that include Vo3, their most advanced AI video model that understands physics, generates natural sounds, and creates perfect lip-sync dialogues that look impossibly real. Next is Flow, a revolutionary AI video creation tool that lets you simply type what you want and get high-quality videos with precise camera controls in minutes. Then Project Astra and Gemini Live that transforms your phone into a visual AI assistant that can see. and understand everything around you in real time and finally google's stunning new ai glasses that will give you hands free access to gemini while looking stylish enough to wear it all day hi this is divyanshi and welcome to the cutting edge school enabled by 01 network by zerotha in this video we'll cover all these important announcements and explain how exactly they can impact us without further ado let's get started number 1 google beam Google has finally transformed Project Starline into Google Beam and trust me this is going to completely change how we connect with people remotely. The core feature is that Google Beam lets you have a video call with someone in 3D. So it literally feels like they are sitting right in front of you. Because the system uses six cameras to record you from multiple angles, AI can merge those recordings and render you on a 3D display in real time. The technical magic happens with near perfect head tracking at 60 frames per second. To make it very simple it transforms the flat 2d video stream we're all used to into something that feels genuinely immersive and realistic think about it if this does what it actually promises it could revolutionize remote work family connections for people living far apart and even telemedicine where doctors need to see patients with perfect clarity google has partnered with hp to make beam available to early customers later this year I'm genuinely excited to try this one out because the demos looked absolutely mind blowing. Number 2, Project Miner AI agent. Next, Google revealed major updates to Gemini Live with Project Astra's camera and screen sharing capabilities plus Project Miner, their groundbreaking AI agent system. Sundar Pichai wonderfully explained it Agents are systems that combine the intelligence of AI models with access to tools. It's basically AI that can interact with websites and systems to get things done for you. The craziest part is that Project Miner can multitask and handle up to 10 different tasks simultaneously. But what really blew my mind was the teach and repeat feature. So if you show it a task just once, it learns a plan for similar tasks in the future. It's like having an intern who can never forget anything you teach them. With Gemini Live's new capabilities, you can speak to it, ask questions, practice for job interviews, or even get a training partner for your marathon. It's literally like having an AI assistant in your pocket at all times. This feature is already available for everyone on Android and iOS. The computer use capabilities for Project Miner will be available to developers through the Gemini API this year. Just imagine what creative developers will build once they get their hands on this. Number 3, Gemini 2.5 Pro DeepThink. Google introduced Gemini 2.5 Pro DeepThink and it's pushing the limits of what AI models can do. This model delivers groundbreaking results and tops the charts in hard mathematics and other benchmarks. What makes this special is that it's not just about answering questions. It's about truly understanding and simulating the world. Google calls this concept world models and it's basically creating an AI that can understand how things work in reality. One example they showed was the Genie 2 model, which can generate interactive 3D simulated environments from just a single image prompt. I was watching this demo thinking, how is this even possible? They're also making huge strides with Gemini Robotics, a specialized model that teaches robots to grasp objects, follow complex instructions and adjust to tasks in real time. This isn't just theoretical. It's AI that can interact with and manipulate the physical world. Right now the DeepThink model is available only to trusted testers, but it shows where Google is headed. The transition from AI that just processes information to AI that can understand and interact with physical world is happening much faster than most people expected. Number 4, Vio. Google just showed off Vio 3, their most advanced AI video model yet. 
And I'm telling you, this is miles ahead of anything we have seen before. The breakthrough here is that VO3 actually understands physics. So if any element falls in your generated video, it follows a natural arc. No more of those weird glitches or objects floating unnaturally like we saw in older models. The video genuinely respects the laws of physics now. But what really impressed me was the audio capabilities. VO3 gives you natural sound effects, realistic background ambience, and this is the craziest part. This ocean, it's a force, a wild, untamed might. And she commands your awe with every breaking light. Perfectly lip-synced character dialogues with emotional delivery. You can now specify exactly what you want your characters to say right in your prompts and the AI makes sure their lips match perfectly. I watched these demos thinking, is this even AI generated? Because the quality is becoming indistinguishable from professionally short footage. The implications for content creators, filmmakers and anyone working with videos are just massive. Number five. Flow. Building on VO3 capabilities, Flow has taken AI video creation to the next level in a super simple way. This isn't just another incremental improvement, it's a completely new approach to video creation. With Flow, you can just type what you want and it creates it. You can add images or generate them using Flow itself. Assemble them together and describe how you want your video to turn out all in simple language. No need to learn complex video editing software or terminology. The most groundbreaking feature is called Extend. Once you have created a scene, you can either jump to the next scene or simply extend the current one. Flow understands the context and will continue your video in a way that feels perfectly cohesive and natural. This is going to completely transform how content creators, marketers and educators make videos. Tasks that would normally take days of shooting and editing can now be done in minutes with results that look professionally produced. So folks, here I am at a live booth where we are making videos using Flow. So if I wear these headphone models, I will not only get to see what AI has made, but also hear dialogues between two different characters. And let me just put these on. So folks, it's going to be difficult for me to explain you verbally, but you will be amazed at the realism, the kind of quality the voiceover has, the sound effects has. And this gives creators immense power, immense freedom in what they can create with just their creativity. So as you can see, we have my prompt ready. I had written text on building that says Unch in a metal that's shiny cyberpunk Lego world. And as you can see, it has maintained every little part of my prompt. The camera angles are smooth, the spellings are smooth, and it's absolutely gorgeous. I am personally supremely excited to try this out and actually show this in demo on the YouTube channel. Let me know in the comment section if this was your favorite because for me, this was the highlight of the day. Number six, Project Muhan. Google's hardware announcements were just as impressive as their software updates. They announced Project Muhan, a VR headset with Android XR that can help you visualize any place in the world using Google Maps, chat with an AI assistant, and even watch sports as if you're actually in the stadium. While there haven't been any estimates about pricing yet, this VR headset will be available later this year. But the announcement that really caught my attention was their new Google Glasses with AI Assistant built in. These aren't like the original Google Glass. They're designed to be lightweight so you can wear them all day without discomfort. They feature a front-facing camera and microphone so Gemini can take pictures and have context to provide translations and information in real time. They also include speakers to play music, take calls, or listen to AI responses. The optional in-lens display privately shows you directions, sends calendar invites, and provides helpful information in real time. And since they connect to your phone, you have access to all your apps while keeping your hands free. The game changer here is that Google has partnered with eyewear brands like Gentle Monster and Warby Parker to design glasses that actually look stylish. They look like normal glasses you'd want to wear anyway. Number seven, AI mode. Google has introduced AI mode for an end-to-end -end AI search experience, and it's going to completely change how we have been using search for decades. This new mode is specifically designed for advanced reasoning, allowing you to ask AI about more complex problems that traditional search just isn't equipped to handle. Instead of getting a list of links that you need to sift through manually, AI mode gives you comprehensive structured answers directly. Think about all those times you had to open multiple tabs and piece together information yourself. AI mode does it all now by itself. 
It can analyze multiple sources, reconcile conflicting information and present you with a complete answer that considers all relevant factors. This feature is already available for all users in the US with global rollout planned for later this year. Number 8. Google Shopping AI Features plus Agentic Checkout Google just introduced incredible AI-powered shopping features. And as someone who shops online regularly, I can tell you this is going to be a game changer. The new shopping experience lets you virtually try on clothes by simply uploading your photo. It maps your body shape and uses diffusion models to show exactly how that outfit would look on you. No more guessing or disappointing deliveries. But it goes beyond just clothes. If you search for something like finding a rug for the living room, it actually tells you what features you need based on your specific living situation. Once you give the prompt, it provides personalized recommendations for products that would suit your needs. The revolutionary part is the new agentic checkout feature. You can actually track prices and have the system automatically buy items when they hit your target price using Google Pay. Imagine setting a price alert for that expensive item you've been eyeing and then having the system just handle the purchase for you when it goes on sale. No more missing out on limited time deals. This is shopping reimagined from the ground up and it shows how AI is going to transform even the most common everyday activities. Number 9. Real-time speech translation in Google Meet Google Meet now introduces real-time speech translation and it's honestly one of those features that seems like magic when you see it in action. It's amazing how it can match the speaker's tone, patterns and expressions all while translating in real time. This isn't just flat translation, it preserves the emotion and the emphasis of the original speaker which is crucial for effective communication. This feature is available directly in Google Meet right now. Currently, the only language available are English and Spanish, but Google promised more languages will be added throughout the year. Just think about how this will transform global business meetings, international education, and remote team collaboration. Number 10. Imagine 4 Google's new Imagine 4 image generation model is taking AI-created visuals to a whole new level. This isn't just a minor update. It's offering enhanced realism and detailed visuals that look genuinely professional. The most impressive improvement is with typography. Previous models struggled with text and images, often creating weird gibberish or text that breaks apart if you look closely. Imagine 4 gets the text right with proper spacing, alignment, and even creative choices like adding texture to fonts. The image generation is now available directly in the Gemini app with fine grain details and more texture. Imagine 4 is 10 times faster than the previous model, which means less waiting and more creating. Number 11. Lyria 2. Lyria 2 is a Google state-of-the-art AI model for generating music. And it's not just impressive, it's industry changing. This model creates professional grade music across a wide range of genres, classical, jazz, pop, electronic, you name it and it can compose it. What makes Lyria 2 special is that it was developed with input from actual musicians and producers. It offers granular control over musical elements, enabling you to shape compositions to your specific vision. One more bass, different tempo, more emphasis on certain instruments, you can adjust all of that. YouTube creators and filmmakers can generate custom soundtracks for their videos without worrying about copyright issues. Lyria 2 is available via the Gemini API and Vertex AI Studio, which means developers can generate music from text prompts and integrate it into applications. Number 12. Google AI Studio Google AI Studio now lets you generate images in a 3D sphere, which is a totally new way to think about AI image creation. Instead of just flat 2D images, you can now create immersive, three-dimensional visual content. They also introduced Gemini Diffusion, an experimental text diffusion model that leverages parallel generation to achieve extremely low latency. In plain language, it's about five times faster than 2.5 flash light, which was already impressively quick. Beyond just creating images, the system can provide mathematical solutions and show all the steps clearly. It slows down at crucial points to make sure you understand the process, not just the answer. For creators and developers, this opens up entirely new possibilities for immersive content, virtual environments, and interactive experiences that simply weren't possible with 2D generation. Number 13. 
Firesat. Moving beyond consumer tech, Google has announced Firesat, which uses a combination of satellite imagery and AI to detect forest fires. This is the technology that could literally save lives and protect our environment. Their current system has one satellite and a response time of 12 hours, but eventually they plan to reduce the response time to just 20 minutes. When you are dealing with rapidly spreading wildfires, that kind of early detection could be the difference between a contained incident and a devastating disaster. This is a perfect example example of how AI can be applied to solve real-world problems, not just make our digital lives more convenient. Climate change is increasing the frequency and intensity of wildfires worldwide, and having technology that can provide early warnings could be a game-changer for emergency response teams. Google AI Pro and Ultra Pricing Plans Google announced two pricing models for their AI tools, and it's clear that they are targeting both enthusiasts and serious professionals. The first is Google AI Pro at $20 per month, which gives you access to Gemini 2.5 Pro and Vue 2 in the Gemini app, Flow with VO2, Whisk with VO2, Notebook LM with higher limits, Gemini integration in Gmail, Google Doc, Wids, and Gemini in Chrome with a 2 TB storage. For those who need the absolute cutting edge, there's a Google AI Ultra at $250 per month. This unlocks the highest level of access, including Gemini 2.5 Pro and VO3 in the Gemini app, Flow and Whisk with VO3, Notebook LM with the highest limits, Project Minor, YouTube Premium, 30 TB of storage, and all the features from the Pro plan. Both plans are available in the US today, with the Ultra plan coming to other countries soon. For professionals and businesses that can leverage these tools effectively, even the Ultra plan could be a bargain considering what it enables you to create. Next, we have future projects. Looking ahead, Google shared their vision for the next few years, and it's genuinely exciting to see where they're focusing their efforts. They are working on building helpful robots that can assist in everyday tasks, finding treatments for the world's deadliest diseases using AI to analyze complex biological data, advancing quantum computers to solve problems that are currently impossible to tackle, and developing fully autonomous vehicles that could transform transportation as we know it. What's clear from these announcements is that Google isn't just focused on incremental improvements to existing products. They are investing in moonshot projects that could fundamentally change how we live, work and solve some of the humanity's biggest challenges. Now, I know a lot of this sounds exciting, but also potentially overwhelming. And I also know that many jobs will be redefined as these technologies mature. But see, every 10 years, a revolution happens, and it's our responsibility to make sure that we evolve and adapt. So what should you focus on in this rapidly changing landscape? Let me share three key areas. Firstly, instead of becoming a specialized executor who just follows checklists, consider becoming a T-shaped journalist. Find one specific domain and get end-to-end -end expertise, but also start exploring complementary fields. Don't restrict yourself to saying, I will just code or I will just design or I will just manage. Second, make sure you're taking utmost care of your mental and physical health. Third, please improve your writing and speaking skills. All of these AI tools require you to either speak clearly or write clearly to get the best results. Your ability to articulate what you want will determine how effective those tools are for you. Google I.O. 2025 has shown us that we are entering a new era of AI, one where these tools become true partners in our work and daily lives rather than just fancy utilities. For those who embrace these changes and learn how to leverage these new capabilities, the opportunities are enormous. Comment below which of these announcements excited you the most and what questions you have about how to adapt to these changes. If you are here for the first time, make sure you click on subscribe and hit the bell icon so you never miss an update. With that being said, I hope you're taking care of your mind and body. My name is Devyanshi and you are watching The Cutting Edge School enabled by 01 Network by Zerotha. If you want to learn more about AI and prompting, here's a playlist that will teach it to you from scratch.